Federal officials have arrested two men in connection to the death of Run DMC's Jam Master J. It comes 18 years after the legendary DJ was killed in Queens. CBS 2's Kevin Rincon has that story. Jam Master J was known the world over. He was a DJ for Run DMC, born in Brooklyn, raised in Queens. His death 18 years ago still hurts. Last time I saw him, he was in the park playing baseball with the kids. It devastated us all. We didn't know what to do. We just loved Jay. In Hollis, a mural in honor of Jam Master Jay still sits to this day. Rappers look up to Jam Master Jay like, because he, he set the outlet for us to do what we wanted to do in the industry. While many still remember his work, what was left unknown until now is why he was killed and who did it. That question now answered after a grand jury returned indictments on Carl Jordan Jr. and Ronald Washington. And they walked in and they murdered him in cold blood. Federal prosecutors revealed in court documents Jam Master Jay, whose real name is Jason Mizell, had been trafficking cocaine. They say Jordan and Washington plotted his murder after they were cut out of a deal. For NYPD Chief of Detectives Rodney Harrison, these charges carry some significance. Me being a native of Queens, uh, and being a big fan of Run DMC and Jam Master J, uh, making this arrest was very, very important to me. Meanwhile, just two blocks from where that crime was committed, there's still reminders of the legacy left behind. Run DMC, they were like superheroes. Eric Jewell Dabney never met Jay, but their stories are intertwined. My actual poster that was in the studio at the time when we acquired him. Years after Jay was killed, he leased the same studio space where he was gunned down. He found records, home movies, posters, all left behind. He's now created a new studio space just two blocks away in an effort to keep his memory alive. You see him everywhere. Murals, the one like we have downstairs, all throughout Queens and just all over. He was, a, you know, a global icon. And downstairs is where Raph painted a mural to Jam Master Jay. That's what hip hop is, you know, you leave a legacy and, and, and not everyone dies a legend. Kevin Rincon, CBS 2 News. Jay's family released a statement overnight thanking fans for their support and said they hope indictments are a step towards getting justice for his murder.